Hi, I'm Gail C., Director of Teaching and Learning, and this week I have Linda Inlay with me. Linda is visiting us from California, mm -hmm. and she is with an organization that originally, I guess, started in Hawaii, the um, Hoala mm -hmm. organization. Um, and I'm just going to ask Linda what it is that she's been doing here for us. She's been working with the middle school. So I am doing work uh, related to uh, school culture, which is you know, whether a culture of an organization is one of the most difficult. Um, and uh, it is, since we're tackling school culture, it's everything. So it's a multi-year project. But this year, this time, is beginning with the foundation of trust. Right. And while there is a really healthy uh, level of trust in the middle school, that means um, we want to get to the point where the the trust is such a deeper level that when we're dealing with conflict, um, the conflict is a healthy uh, response to conflict. Right. Yeah. Um, and Linda, when you when you talk about trust, you're talking yeah. about trust on multiple layers, multiple levels. Mm -hmm. Do you want to expand on that a little bit? Yes. Um, so uh, a lot of trust work sometimes can be about techniques you can do, um, but what we're focusing on are the the mindsets that we have, the attitudes, mm -hmm. values, assumptions mm -hmm. we make mm -hmm. about people uh, that can get in the way of trust, and it's really looking inward um, to exploring our own personal, social, emotional um, capacity right. uh, to develop trust. Um, and we've all had experiences where, oh, you know, those untrustworthy experiences, um, we develop armor, as I thought. Mm -hmm. And so there's both the need to um, trust your colleagues so that you can let go of that armor and to be open to receiving trust. So and it reaches out teacher, student, student, teacher, teacher, yes. colleague, yeah. teacher leadership, teacher, parent, all of it. Community wide yeah. trust building. You know, in the end, we want to. Um, really impact the students so that yes. they can be their yes. best selves. Yes. But if we just do the work with the students without really the work with the adults, um, then, you know, the that doesn't work as well. Right. The kids know when the adults are not really, um, you know, say if you're teaching growth mindset, right. the students, the teachers are not demonstrating growth mindset, right. then, you know, they'll right. know especially in middle and high school. So Can you tell us just a little bit about how you got into this work and, mm -hmm. and what your journey is that led you to us today? It's really kind of been a journey because mm -hmm. I you know, graduated from the University of Hawaii, got my credential, I was going to work in the public schools and I didn't get a job there. It was a baby boomer. My interview was mm -hmm. in a cafeteria mm -hmm. with, I don't know, probably a hundred other people there. But that uh, misfortune led me to the school where Sister Joan was doing this amazing work um, back in the early 70s about social emotional learning and right. school culture when there weren't even those concepts. So yes. that was the beginning of my journey. It affected yeah. me as a, I became a better parent, mm -hmm. a better educator, right. I think a better human being as a result. And my promise to her before she passed was that I would share this with other schools right. that so that more students would be benefited mm -hmm. by, that, by her wisdom. And it's such important work, and I love the way it connects to, to our mission statement where Absolutely. we talk about not just intellectual development, but personal development, and I think that's just right where you're fitting. So yeah. we thank you for your work and your visit, and we look forward to the results of the work that you're doing now. So thank you for being here with us. I, I have totally enjoyed this, and I just want to say what an amazing uh, middle school staff. Um, I've gotten to know them these past two mm -hmm. days, and um, I'm really hopeful about amazing things happening. So mm -hmm. yeah. yeah, thank you. Thank you. Yeah. All right, thanks.